Beep, beep, everyone. Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks for tuning into the channel. Today we're opening up a subscription box. This is from Collectible Card Club. This is the modern um, PAX Platinum version that costs $60.95. Shipping is free. They send it to you in this box. There's the mailing label. Uh, I rip up the addresses off of that to, for privacy's sake. And let's get into opening this up and see what's inside. Uh, but before we do, let's introduce you to Omar and uh, Grimace. Beep, 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 beep. And for good luck, we like to boop our gnome's nose. This is Nathan. Boop, boop, boop. And I will try to put a link to this product in the description below. Uh, it comes with 15 packs. They have uh, multiple different... Um, packaging available or different um levels of this ranging from i think 20 some bucks all the way up to almost a thousand i'm going to zoom this out so that i can get a good view of this for a possible thumbnail for the video so i think that'll work so hold that for a couple seconds and let's get into opening this up and we're going to just put everything out like that because I can't quite get my hands into these small things. And I the, the, this portion here, you can take this out and you can use this box to hold your oversized cards until you can find um, more, uh, better, safer um, storage of these those things. So we'll put that off to the side and we'll go through these packs and move Nathan over a little further. So we have 2024 Series 1, we have 2023 Bowman Platinum, 2023 Topps Chrome, um, 2023 Topps Update, that's a hobby pack, 2024 Topps Heritage Hobby Pack, Heritage 23 Hobby Pack, Bowman 2024, so this is the new Bowman. I have not opened any of this up, and I wasn't planning on buying any. This is a hobby pack. 2022 Series 1 hobby pack. Uh, 2022 Heritage, that's a hobby pack. Chrome Platinum Anniversary Edition from 2021, that's a hobby pack. 2016 Donruss, wow, that goes way back. Um... I'm not sure if that's a hobby pack or not. I don't see anything around the barcode. So I guess we'll assume this is um, retail. Um, 2022 Topps Chrome Sonic. That's a hobby pack. Uh, 2024 Topps Big League. That's a hobby pack. Uh, 2022 Topps Chrome. That looks like that's retail. And 2023 Heritage Hobby Pack. Oh, that other one was high number. Okay. All right, let's see what we should do. Um, we'll open the big league and the... I don't know what the, when to put the Donruss one in. Big league. We'll do these after big league. Let's do the Bowmans after that. Let's do the Donruss, the Heritage. And... We'll do the chrome in reverse chronological order. <laughs> All right, let's dig in and see what we'll find. This is 2024 Tops Big League, and it's a hobby pack. So what we're kind of looking for here is the higher numbered cards because they are um, sort of like all built-in parallels. Not really parallels, but the base cards are foil and different various colors of foil and they get rarer and rarer the further you go into the set so Cattell Marte Trey Cabbage rookie card Tanner Bybee Zach Galoff rookie card sorry Jorge Polanco Brian Reynolds a uh, good vibrations insert Nolan I'm not sure how his last name is pronounced Chanuel uh, please correct me in the comments. Um, rookie card insert, I guess. Mm. 
I guess I'll put that there. Jeff McNeil is a rainbow foil, uh, number 220. So I think cards after 200 are the foils begin and they're printed in lesser quantities than the earlier part of the base set. So that's nice. At least we got one of those. Uh, 2022 Series 1 Hobby Pack. Beep, beep. Oh, I uh, beep between pack openings. Uh, I know it's a little weird, but it is what I do. I think it's fun. If you want to join along, please do so. And please leave a beep beep in the comments section. I'd very much appreciate that. Patrick Wisdom. Eric Hosmer. Mike Moustakas letting out a big burp. Marco Gonzalez. Spencer Turnbull. Brandon Crawford. Eduardo Rodriguez, Archie Bradley. Well, that's a neat photo. Why don't I remember that one? <laughs> uh, East Division Smile. That is um, Lindor and uh, not Albies, but is that Jazz Chisholm? Yeah, Jazz Chisholm. For some reason, I get him and Ozzy Albies mixed up. I don't know why. Charlie Morton, Corey Kluber, Eli Morgan, rookie card, Josh Naylor, and Taewon Walker. Beep, beep. Here's 2023 update. Uh, this is a hobby pack. <clears throat> uh, Jordan Walker, rookie debut. Mark Melanson. Edward Julian, rookie card. Zach Nito, rookie card. Brett Phillips. That's a cool photo, completely in the air. Brad Hand. Joey Ortiz, rookie card. Tyler Anderson. Nick Castellanos, all-star game. Jordan Alvarez is a Topps Black Gold. That's nice. Not sure what the Topps Black Golds are worth. Let me... My um, wall there is sort of falling back on me. So I guess we'll call that a hit in a way. It's not like a major hit, but still it's something. Hunter Renfro. And Dylan Floro. It doesn't seem, feel like I have enough room on the table for some reason. Pull that back a little bit. <coughs> Pardon me. 2024 Series 1. Um, that is not a hobby pack. I don't see the H on the front. Uh, Adley Rushman. That's a good one. Andrew Monasterio. Kbert Ruiz. Alika Williams, rookie card. Andrew Abbott, rookie card. Tyler Anderson. Edwin Diaz. We got the uh, home run leaders, Otani, Garcia, and Robert. Uh, Cubs team card. Lane Thomas is a royal blue parallel. I believe that's what that's called. Uh, Sal Freelick is our um, Stars of MLB insert, and it looks like he's a rookie card insert there. And Nathan Evaldi, who's um, the namesake of our gnome over here. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, 2023 Bowman Platinum. Beep, beep. Hoo-hoo! Nick Prado. Noah Miller. Dominic Keegan, Diego Cartea, Precious Elements insert, and Simeon Woods Richardson, rookie card. Not too much going on in that pack. 2024 Bowman, this is the first time I've ever opened this up. I wasn't planning on buying any Bowman, so this is a good way for me to at least get a little bit of it. Nolan Arenado. Adolis Garcia, Chris Bryant, Samad Taylor, rookie card, Colson Montgomery, Bowman Chrome, Bowman AI. All right, they're taking advantage of the AI thing going on, and they're naming their inserts after this silly stuff. <laughs> okay, I'll put that one over there, I guess. Ralphie Velasquez, or Velasquez, Kemp Alderman. Brian Acuna, who I think is related to Ronald. I think he's a, a brother. Yep. Felix Moreau Bell, first Bowman. Not, I pretty, I bet you I botched that last name. Uh, Derniche Valdez. Beep, beep. 
2016 Donruss. I don't think I have ever opened up any 2016 Donruss. Not that long ago, I opened up a pack, I think, of 2014. So this is some older stuff. Miguel Cabrera starts us off. Joey Votto, Andrew McCutcheon, Dallas Keuchel, Rusny Castillo. Uh, what do we got here? Diamond Kings, Jose Fernandez. Why is that in pink? I don't know if that's a parallel or not. I'm not sure. I'm not familiar with the 2016 set of Donruss. So I will have to look that one up to find out what is going on with that. If that's a parallel or if maybe all the cards are that color. I'm going to just put that one aside. Oh, we got something here. Something here big time. Sunny Gray on the uh, retro design. This is Prince Fielder. It's a bat relic. Wow, that's that's really neat looking. I like that shiny blue uh, sort of border. It's kind of like an inner border kind of thing going on there. That's not numbered. Bat Kings. Wow, that's really nice. So that is a nice, nice hit there. I do PC Prince Fielder cards. I remember, I don't remember seeing him play too much because I wasn't following baseball as much back then. But I do remember his dad, Cecil, when um, Cecil had 51 homers. Um, oh, what year was that? 1990 or 91, something like that. This, so this is 2022 Topps Heritage. This is a hobby pack. This is on the old 1973 Topps design. Anthony, pardon me, Anthony D. Sclafani, Devin Williams, Brandon Woodruff, Mark Melanson, Ryan Zimmerman, Jake Berger, rookie card, Brandon Crawford, Luis Frias, rookie card, and Alex Reyes. Oh, I should have checked that for um, possible short prints. Um, I believe they are, what are they numbered, uh, after 400? So none of these are short prints. Okay. And... None of those are short prints either. Nope. Okay. 2023 Tops Heritage. This is a hobby pack. This will be based on the 1974 Tops design. Uh, Paul Goldschmidt. I'll check on the back, make sure they're not short prints. Merrill Kelly. JT Real Muto. Nestor Cortez. Garrett Mitchell rookie card. Dre Jameson. The all star catchers, Wilson Contreras and Alejandro Kirk. Uh, Jermaine Palacios rookie card. 390, that almost made it. Oh, this is from a hot box. This is um, a chrome purple parallel of Key Brian Hayes. I did not have that card, so this is really nice. Uh, I don't think it's worth too much more than the other chrome cards. Uh, maybe a dollar or two. I'm not sure. Maybe three. Uh, 2023 Tops Heritage High Number. This is a hobby pack. So this is also the 74 Tops design. And I think the short prints are numbered from 701 to 725. Joey Weimer rookie card. Logan Allen rookie card. Brett Wisely rookie card. Ryan Jeffers. Nick Matan, 705. He's a short print. So we got a short print. Nick Fortes. Jamer Candelario. Eddie Rosario. And Jake Berger. Beep beep. Uh, 2024 Tops Heritage is based on the 1975 Tops design. Uh, Joey Wendell. Jordan Romano. Coco Montez, rookie card. I've never heard of him. Uh, home run leader, Shohei Otani and Matt Olson. Shohei's having a great year this year. Matt's not so much. CJ Abrams. Austin Riley. Kevin Gossman. Uh, news flashbacks. Margaret Thatcher becomes the British Conservative Party's first woman, first women leader. I thought that you would say woman leader. Okay, Jeremy Pena. Beep, beep. 
I didn't know that happened back in 1975. I thought she started a little bit later than that. Uh, 2023 Topps Chrome. Beep, beep. Not often that uh, British history or British politics comes into a baseball card video, but <laughs> there it goes. I'm not going to say anything else about it. Kevin Gaussman. I don't really follow British politics much. Nate Eaton, rookie card. Uh, Shea Langoliers. Wait, let me check. Make sure these aren't refractors. This one here is Trist Tristan Casas on the 88 design. And uh, we got a CP parallel, Cal Mitchell rookie card. That's nice. Uh, I don't think that's probably worthy of putting on a stand, but um, maybe we'll put that one on the side here. Uh, 2022 Topps Chrome. This is just a regular retail pack. Uh, Joe Adele, Max Muncy, Max Fried, a Prism Parallel. I guess we'll put that one on a stand. Whoops, sorry, Max. Uh, Nico Horner, and Ryan Tapia is on a um, Pink Parallel. Beep beep. Uh, sonar. Uh, that's a hobby pack. So hopefully we'll get something neat in here. Joey Votto, Alec Bohm, Fran Mill Reyes, and Trevor Rogers. So nothing really interesting in there. Uh, the difference between this and um, the regular Chrome is... Um, well, I, I, is basically the numbering on the back is different from these two, and that's how you can tell a sonar card from a regular chrome card. Um, plus, I think the chrome lo logo, if you had another Alec Bohm card, uh, I don't know in, in this case, but for, let's say Joey Votto, I, I don't really know offhand, but the Topps Chrome lo lo logo may be over here instead of there. Uh, that was something that they, they did to distinguish them from each other although that's not always the case because the photo won't allow them to do that for every single one but there is a number code on the back and the numbering code for sonar and chrome are different from each other so this is 2021 platinum anniversary edition hobby pack uh, one of my favorite sets it's based on the 1952 tops design We've got larry doby miguel sano Denelson LeMay and Carlos Hernandez rookie card that is a refractor. Okay. All right, that's our box of um, collectible card club um, platinum edition modern packs. Uh, they also issue like boxes of older packs, and there's like different price ranges. Um, I'll put a link to this exact product down in the description below so you can have a look at it. So some of the weird cards here, we got a refractor of Carlos Hernandez rookie card, a pink parallel of Romeo Tapia, sepia parallel of Cal Mitchell. I don't know if this is a parallel or not because I don't know the 2016 Don reset much at all. So I might be wrong about that, but you know, the pink color sort of stands out. Usually pink parallels are numbered to 25, but this has no numbering on it. Um, Max Fried uh, prism refractor. Uh, Key Brian Hayes, uh, Hotbox Purple Chrome Refractor. Uh, Jordan Alvarez, Topps Black Gold Insert. And I guess the biggest hit was this um, Bat Relic of Prince Fielder from 2016 Donruss Bat Kings. All right, so that takes care of that. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Uh, have a great rest of your day. Take care, everybody. Thanks for, for watching. Beep, beep.